You look troubled, Cassandra. It's pain. It is familiar somehow. A bird can fly away for seasons, but will always recognize its nest when it returns. This is Sparta. I don't think I'm welcome here. I'm not sure of much, Cassandra, but I do know that when the time is right, we always get to go home. And where is your home, Barnabas? I'll save that story for another day. Get that sail up! Ready oars for docking! You made it. I trust the seas were favorable? Poseidon might be the only one not trying to kill me. And did you go to Thera? Did you find him? I did. What did he tell you? He told me where I'm from. And where I must go. So now you know the truth. I'm not his daughter. I'm just a weapon. That is the furthest thing from the truth. You were brought into this world with love. I never imagined we'd stand on Spartan soil together again. I don't know how to feel. I spent some of the happiest days of my life here. And some of the worst, too. Sparta is our home. But we'll have to rid ourselves of the Puppet King if we are ever to find peace. Whatever happened to our old house? Nikolaos stayed after I left, but now that he's gone, I don't know. Why don't we go find out? Of course. But first, there's something I want to show you. No matter how far I ran, I never could escape them. I know. On Naxos I could forget. It was as if I had locked Sparta in a box and tossed it to the bottom of the sea. Did you put your memories of us in that box? I wanted to. But it would have taken all the wood in the land to build one big enough.
Let's go. <laughs> Off we go now. <laughs> This is where I first trained you to use your spear. Hesitation only hastens the grave. <laughs> you remembered. How do you think I got this far? We had to pry that spear from your hand while you slept. You said you needed it to fight the monsters in your dreams. I couldn't face Cerberus empty-handed. Those children will be ripped to shreds. We should help them. Cassandra, wait. You mustn't interfere. This is Spartan training territory. I hope you're right. For their sake. The Agogi is what turns boys into men. Interfering would only weaken them, weaken Sparta. They're no good to Sparta if we leave them to die. And they're no good to Sparta if they're too weak to kill a wolf. Come. Let's go home. Not ruthless. <laughs> Let's go. The best of those boys will become Cryptia, keepers of the peace and stalkers in the night. Stalkers in the night? There's a reason Spartan never changes. It has rules, they are strict. Spartans rule Laconia, and most of its citizens are Illocas, enslaved peasants made to work in fields and mines. Slaves? Why don't they revolt? Spartan fields keep When they forget their place, <laughs> are ordered to keep their peace. I see. Most of us make great sacrifices for comfort. Most. Not all. back in Sparta. It looks so peaceful, despite the war raging elsewhere. And last place I ever felt safe. As soon as you were old enough to hold a spear, you trained in this yard from morning till night. Nicolaus was a tough teacher to please. He hid his pride from you. But every night he would tell me, she's going to bring glory to Sparta. As much as I hate him for what he did, I wouldn't be who I am today without his training. My heart broke that day. But for the first time in ages, standing here with you, I truly believe it can mend again. Me too. Do you remember the first time you held your brother? I was scared I'd break him. I piled every blanket and pillow we had around me. Even then, you held him so tight, I thought you would squeeze the life out of him. 
he turned out stronger than we thought. The gods must be playing tricks on my eyes. Good to see you, Vrasidas. It's been a long time since I rescued you from the warehouse fire in Corinth. <laughs> That's not how I remember it. You look well, Brasidas. The rumors were true. You're alive! Many we thought to be dead are still breathing. When I heard the two of you came home... We're in Sparta, but we're not home yet. We want our house back, Vrasidas. Sparta claimed your estate after Nikolaos' disappearance. They're waiting for his adopted son to claim it. But he hasn't returned from the war. Stentor? I knew I should have killed him on the beach. What do we have to do to get it back? You'll need to negotiate your Spartan citizenship with the kings. It won't be easy. Why not? As happy as I am to see you, the kings won't be. Especially Achidamus. Your exit from Sparta wasn't exactly... graceful. He can't still be mad I broke his nose. You what? In any case, he hasn't forgotten. But I have an idea that might help him forgive. Tell us. Spartan soldiers have been giving weapons to the Ilotes. Whoever takes care of these traitors will earn his thanks. Why on earth would Spartan soldiers be helping Ilotes? Ilotes greatly outnumber Spartan citizens. But they're leaderless, mostly farmhands, servants, and apprentices. If someone unified them, armed them, and trained them, they'd be a real threat to Sparta. But you said it was Spartans who were arming them. All the more reason to deal with this quickly. You find out why the Ilotes are being armed, and you'll have the King's attention. Where will I find these Spartans? They were last spotted in the Gorani Marble Quarry, in the forest of Eurotas. So, I find the soldiers. Then what? Spartans are loyal to their commander. Take him out, and the rest should disperse. And the weapons? Destroy them. The Elotes have caused enough trouble with shovels and sickles. <laughs> the last thing Sparta needs right now is them carrying swords. So, to get our house back, I must take out the Spartan commander responsible for inciting a useless rebellion. Sounds easy enough. Find me in the throne room when it's done. And where will you be? This is where I raised you. It's also where Leonidas raised me. I'm going to visit his tomb just beyond the estate. You should pay your specs too before you get started. I'll try. <laughs>